Oh my god, we finally have something we can kill. Here we go. We gotta kill him. Oh, he's a 540. This might take a minute. I probably should have tamed him. This poor little Listro. I'm so sorry, man. I just need hide. I need a bed. The poor little porcupine Listro. back to a brand new video tbf gaming jumping back into arc survival evolved primal fear on the hope map and the extinction map so we should be able to travel between both maps and really get deep into this mod but primal fear obviously you guys know primal fear it's one of the biggest mods out there i think every youtuber's done it a few times and i think there's a couple doing it right now i believe miola's still doing it i know axeman just finished it and moved on to supreme a little bit while back and i'm sure there's some other ones out there that i'm missing but definitely one of the best mods out there we wanted to give it one more run before Arc Ascended comes out. Obviously, we can still play some of these mods, and some of these mods might end up in Arc Ascended, but we're trying to do kind of one last run through of a lot of our favorite mods. But this should be a lot of fun. This is a patron server. Should be some death and destruction over here. There is so many bad things over there. Also, that is that a glow or is that just a. Okay, I think it's just the hue of the air, the, the sky over there. I thought it was like one of the big primals. I don't know. This, this could be a lot of fun, but the, the map is definitely full disaster mode. We're going to have to see what happens here in the next few days. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Like, comment, subscribe. Like I said, huge shout out to the patrons because they allow me to run all these servers. Couldn't do it without them. And if you guys are interested in playing one of these servers, definitely uh, consider either joining the Patreon or going down to the YouTube membership down below. So definitely check that out. But yeah, let's go ahead and get on this. Uh, we got the two maps going. Plus, we just started up Eternal a couple days ago too. It's been kind of a crazy couple days. All right, I need wood, man. We need wood so we can make our first tool. We are not having luck. While we're doing this, let's talk about the rates on the server. It's times two XP, times four gather, and times six or seven taming. Did I get no wood out of that? Wow. None. None whatsoever. Let's go try this over here. Make sure I got some stones. There you go. I just need wood. Do we not get wood from those? We don't. That fire guy makes me super nervous. But as long as he's way down there, everything's okay. All right, let's grab some more here. Like I've grabbed everything over here. Let's grab this one. Please give me some wood, maybe. There we go. All right. I literally just need one wood, and then we can make it. There we go. Got it. All right. Now we can make a stone. That one. Get this going. Oh, man. I wonder why they're just sitting there like that. I'm good with it. I'd rather them do that than come over here. All right. Let's go with our first pickaxe. Now we can get a little bit of this and get our first hatchet going. We'll get a couple levels pumped up in real quick, too. But the first level should be pretty quick. Oh, we got metal. Nice. If we don't die, we have a little bit of metal to get started. Obviously, that's a ways off. But you know it's modded. We're going to go quickly through the levels. We're going to go quickly through a lot of this stuff. But the first couple days, we're going to go kind of solo. And then we should be moving in with the tribe on day three or four. We'll move in with the tribe and kind of get started there. Let's go four to two because we do plan on going to some other, other places. Let's go like that. Let's make ourselves a... I need a spear, but we need way more fiber for that. So let's go grab fiber. Oh, man, I don't want to because every time we go closer, I find another bad thing over here. There's a Uranus over there, too. Hopefully he doesn't come this way. And I think I saw a thorny dragon. But unfortunately, no no little vanilla, guys. I need, like, a dodo or something. There's a bag there. Oh, I want that. I'm not going to venture that far, though. We're not going to risk it. Let's get a little bit more fiber, and then let's get our first couple thatch foundations here in a second. All right, we need the reusable spear from Lethal's Reusables. We also have the fog remover from... The Fister's Fog Remover, which is awesome. Get rid of a little bit of this fog. Let's put that down now. See if it helps out. Did it help? Maybe it wasn't really fog here. It's a little... It's just that fog over there. Maybe it's the desert over there. I'm not sure. All right, let's go with that one, with that one. Okay. And then we have the no durability armor that we can get started with, which is the cloth pants and the shirt. We'll get those. Make our first campfire. There you go. And there's our level that we needed. Let's put another one into... Let's start going wait a little bit. So we'll have plenty of wait. And I think we unlock thatch now. There you go. Now we, now we can start making our foundations. There you go. Nine of those. Let's go. All right. Very cool. This should be a lot of fun, though. You guys know I love Primal Fear. And it's been a while since we got a chance to beat it. Last time we played it was with Eternal. So it didn't really get its own shake. And then before that was like a year before that and we we started it we made it i think like 20 something episodes in and then i got really sick that was during the uh the crazy times in the you know across the world uh, let's see go there go there one all right cool this will get us a couple levels early on too which is perfect and i really hope there's please be like something small that we can attack like a dillo a compi something 
What is it? Oh, not Terror Bird? No. No, no, no. Terror Birds are the worst. Hold on. Can I get walls up yet? Hold on. I can get one wall. Okay. Let's get these foundations down. Dang it. Our day is definitely going to get ruined. We are also going to bring back the TVFG rip counter, the death counter, in this playthrough. So there should be a nice giant amount of deaths. I think our record for deaths in the season was a little over a 100. I'm excited to kind of see where we go in this one. Obviously, you guys know I've never actually died. We're at zero official deaths. You know, the one life challenge forever. But, you know, the, the death counter might still be a thing. All right. Let's sneak up here. I need more fiber, but I really don't want to get in trouble by that guy. I gotta stay close enough to the water so we can go jump in the water. Those parrots seem to be having a little bit of an issue. Please don't. No, no, I think he just aggroed. Go, 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 go. Hopefully there's no bad things in the water right here. No, no, terror bird, toxic, jerk. As you guys know, the tribe has not been created yet, which means that death obviously doesn't count, so we're still officially at zero deaths this playthrough. Oh, we started really close, okay. We're really, really close. Uh, I don't know if you guys are aggressive. Please don't be aggressive. Alright. I kind of need the supplies, but he's going to come get us again. No, no. The terror bird, I can feel him. There you go. He was breathing on our neck right there. There you go. You go fight that guy. Perfect. Oh, that's a elemental parrot. Did that parrot just wreck him? You did. Parrot, I love you. I know we can't tame you anytime soon, but you're our new best friend. That's our buddy Squawks. Alright, let's go grab that. Yeah, they're cool, man. That's one thing cool, too. We have the pickup mod on here, the loot pickup mod. So all you have to do is tap the G button if you get close enough to a bag like that. So you can do a kind of a little kamikaze death run and see if you can grab any bags on the ground. So that's huge. All right. Uh, since he didn't eat my body, we just have to grab it. That is a Capro out there. Is it a fiery Capro or just a regular Capro? I don't know. Okay, let's just go. Ooh. Can we get a little bit of meat? We can. We've got food. Dang it. Yeah, there's a capper out there, and there's something red out there. That That's the UD. Oh, good. The UD's in the water. That's perfect. Stay right over there. Let's go grab this bag over here while it's clear. It's clear and quiet for at least a minute. Let's grab this. Boom. Uh, oh, someone's specimen implant. <laughs> someone else died over here. Nice. <laughs> All right. Okay, cool. Let's finish up a little bit of fiber, a little bit more thatch, and let's finish out our little thatch hut so we can hide. There we go. Too bad they didn't leave the terror bird there. We could have actually gathered the terror bird. Grab that. A little bit more fiber, and then we'll run back and build our walls. We'll get some walls up. We'll be super, super safe in our little thatch hut. Uh, as long as something gigantic doesn't come along. We'll have to go see what that bag is, too. All right. No durability cloth, which is one of the Fister mods. And then we need to go wall action. Let's go like that. And I need, was it 3, 6, 9, 12, 23. So 22 more. Nice. And then we'll go door. Get a door and a door. We'll get a couple levels out of this. Let's kind of see what else we've unlocked early on. Uh, we want to start doing, let's start doing stamina and health. We're going to be doing running and dying a lot. So some of the, just kind of the basic stuff. Okay, so nothing nothing crazy yet. Nothing good. Obviously, we got the sleeping bag, even though I can't make that. Neat spoiler. That's really cool looking. Fire and ice feather mixture. Hmm. I've never seen that. Yeah, and it's been a while since we played just Primal Fear on its own. We also have the Primal Fear unofficial extras on here, which is an incredible mod. Adds some really cool Primal Fear stuff. There you go. Boom. Let's go ahead and throw this over here. I will make sure the mod list is down below, and here in a couple days I will post the INI over on the mod list as well. Uh, we're going to start kind of getting a little bit better at doing that for sure. All right, cool. We're getting a couple little levels out of this. Let's go with some more walls. All right. While we're doing that, let's go another level. There you go, level 7. That unlocks beds. That's big. And a spyglass, which obviously I don't have crystal yet, but we can at least do a spyglass now. Man, we really need... I need, like, some dodos or something down here. Okay, we'll wait it out just a little bit longer. All right, let's go like that. Once we get this, we can at least make the run. All right, we'll go like that. Is that, is that the, the fire guy? Yep, as long as he's over there, everything's good. And as long as we don't hear the primal music, we're good. 
we go. Just a couple more. Awesome. We'll get the door up, and then we'll feel super safe. Minus the fact that it's thatch. Alright, one more. Oh, gotta wait for the door. Oh, do we got a camp. We have the campfire already. Let's put that down. We'll get a little bit of meat going so we can eat. Uh, I don't have a lot of wood yet. There you go. Alright, and then door. There you go. We are officially a beach bob. Let's go. Alright, now I just need to grab a little bit more supplies. And then we'll get ourselves some sealing action. Let's do that. And we're going to have to venture just a little bit further down and see if we can get lucky. We need something that we can kill. Alright, the rest will do thatch. Let's go a little further down. Tons of thatch. We'll grab a little more fiber while we're running. Alright, I just don't want to get too far that we're going to get just wrecked over here. There's a velo way over there. Oh, there's a wyvern. <laughs> Not cool. Alright, we got wyverns. We got a big old bear. And a really big tail over there. I don't know what that is. Okay. Ellie, you know what? If nothing else, our little peninsula is nice and quiet. I'm good with this. If it can just stay like this, I'll be super happy. All right, let's run back and at least get ourselves a ceiling made. And then we'll see if we can venture out and hopefully get something done today. Uh, let's see. Also, what did we get from that terror bird? We got a couple arrows. I got potent trank arrows. Nice. That'll help out with something small that we knock out. I wish there was like a dillo or something. <laughs> That'd be awesome. All right, go inside. Okay, I need ceilings real quick. We just need nine. There we go. Nine ceilings. We'll get those put up. Feeling pretty good. There you go, man. This is a good start, at least. Good start. Good start. All right. We got lucky where we respawned, for sure. All right. There you go. Got that. All right. Now it's just the waiting game. I think I can make an OCD. Like that. Get a little bit of storage going. All right, and now we just kind of wait and hope something good spawns in down here. Like, just any anything vanilla. There's the rain. All right. More ceilings up. Sweet. Last one. Get an OCD out. There we go. Uh, it's floating. My bad. Let's go like that. There we go. There you go. Now it's down. All right. We'll drop everything in there. And then we'll go out and gather a little bit more. Just that way if we die, we don't lose all of our stuff out here. All right. Uh, we're going to have to venture down just a little bit. i got to find something that we can get for some hide. So, unfortunately, we have to go this way. Unless you hear a dodo or something over here. Which I have not heard anything yet. What is this? Oh, it looked like something. It is not. Alright, let's creep a little bit towards the swamp. Okay. Pretty quiet over here. It's really quiet. Kind of making me nervous. Okay. It's quiet. It's very dark. It's like really shady. Oh, there we go. It's a Diplo. Okay. Okay. Now, the problem is a lot of these guys, also one thing we, we did do as well, we typically try to go 150 for Primal Fear because 150 is where it's based off of, but we went 600 on the levels just to have a lot of fun with it. This is our last hurrah into it, so we, we don't really care about playing it like super official. We just want to have fun with it, and that's where we're going with level 600. Should make it a little crazy. There's something red over there. That's not going to work. Oh, my God, we finally have something we can kill. Here we go. We got to kill him. Oh, he's a 540. This might take a minute. I probably should have tamed him. Also, I'm not seeing damage numbers. Why is there no damage numbers? Why is there no damage numbers? Am I not able to attack him? Why is there no damage numbers? There should be damage numbers. There's definitely not. Uh-oh. We'll have to check that out. I'll have to check out the settings and see why it's not showing. All right. Well, we're just going with it. This poor little Listro. I'm so sorry, man. I just need hide. I need a bed. 
The poor little porcupine Listro. There you go. He's getting bloody. Yes. Got it. Okay. There we go. Give me all those, those spears back. Okay. Give me some hide. Yes. We can make a bed. There you go. That was the big achievement of the day. Also, there's someone else on the beach. They're stealing all my trees. All right. Let's go this way. Let's go drop in here. And now we can make a bed. Boom. Yeah. There you go. Now we're good to go. Now everything else is easy because now we can get back to our base. There you go. Got it. Got it. All right. We need we need more stuff. Let's keep going. All right. Killing that Listro and doing a little bit of gathering. We're up four more levels. There is a Wyvern right out there in the water. Oh, man. He's definitely going to end up over here. Please don't come this way, buddy. Don't come this way. Nothing to see over here. All right. Let's get these four levels in. Let's go like that, like that, like that. And one more into wait. Let me see what we unlocked there. I should have unlocked wood, which we can convert our base to wood now. Let's do that. We'll convert to wood. That'll give us a little bit more XP. If we can get all the way up to level 20, we can just straight beach bob it all the way into, you know, a forge and a smithy. That'd be amazing. We could definitely work towards that. All right. Let's uh, start transferring this to wood. So we'll go wood foundations. Boom. That'll give us more levels. We're already level 14. Got our one kill. Got our bed. This is kind of not, like, super exciting for a primal fear, but pretty good so far it's a good start all right there you go all right we'll keep getting those we'll get some more supplies back as we do that let's go gather some stuff while we're waiting oh it feels like he's hovering closer every minute that guy he's gonna keep giving us trouble all right we got three more levels just from building that stuff let's keep doing this speed stam we're gonna be doing nothing but running level 17 already let's go inside keep replacing these We're up to almost all of wood. All right, some more wood. Not like this will matter if something bad comes over here, but at least we're, you know, making progress. And we got... Oh, I might have made too many. Did I? Nope, we're good. All right, wood foundation there. Uh, no, we did too many. My bad. Okay, that's fine. We'll do that. All right, cool. Once that all clears out, so we have all wood foundations now. Now I just need wood walls. Oh, and we actually unlocked a bench. Hold on. Looks like we can do... We can do the, the table seed. Okay. We can do healing stew. That's awesome. We can do the reusable bola. That's kind of big. Uh, we're not going to mess with hide just yet. Not too big of a deal. There you go, man. Not, not too bad. We got a couple good things out of that for sure. All right. And I think we're good. Let's do the AA bench. There we go. All right, we're going to go Bola down here. Let's go ahead and put down the seed bench. And then we'll put down the AA bench. Oh, my bad. We just put it on the fire. Try it again. Okay. AA bench right there. There's another level. We're up to 18. Is it level 20 or 26 for the Smithy and the Forge? Smithy, they're both at 20. We do have the Primal Smithy unlocked already. All right, more gathering, more wood. Let's go. Let's see. What do we have for more walls we need? Just tons of wood. Tons of wood and thatch. We're actually good on fiber. All right, more gathering. Let's go. Here we go. We actually finished all the walls. Nice. Walls complete. And then demo you. And then we need a wooden door. So switch to the wooden doors. Boom. Nice. Get rid of this guy. And, man, this is a, this is a good start. We're doing pretty good so far. Let's demo you. And demo you. I hear death battle music. That's not a good sign. I need to go see where it's at. All right. Awesome. Let's go see if it's... Is it in the water or is it something... Oh, jeez. I think it's just something in the... Oh, it's the... Wy no, it's not the wyvern. It's the shark. Okay. So we got a giant killer shark right there. Also, the UD, while we were out here gathering, I noticed that the UD is now on land. And running around in the swamp area. So hopefully it doesn't come this way. Let's venture this way just a little bit. We could use any kind of hide. I mean, obviously we could try... We could try to, you know, tame something. But there's nothing here to tame. There's nothing tameable. This might be like a no-tame series. I have no idea. That moth would be cool. Uh, there's something out there. Wait, are Diplos passive? Diplos are passive, right? Oh, jeez. No, 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 no. 
Don't die to bugs. That would be so sad. Okay. We're good. Where that? I see a shadow, but I... Oh, there he is. Oh, he's level 360. Jeez. That's too high of a level. Alright, not seeing damage numbers makes me really sad. Why is this a thing? Okay. I will not die to this bug. Okay, just keep hitting him. Got him! Yes! Look at that. Straight battle. Alright, that guy's making me nervous over there. Nice. A little bit of chitin. Let's repair that guy. There you go. We, we survived the vicious battle. Alright, now, as we were saying, that guy should be a passive tame. How bad would it be? Our rates are pretty good on the server, but I don't know how long it'll take. Alright, let's finish this stuff. Uh... There's someone running around naked. Oh, they're fighting compies. There you go. Let's help. Let's help. There you go. All right, let's help. <laughs> 580. This guy's going to take a minute. Come on. I need you to die. Okay, he's running. All right, bowl the back. Look at the spears running. <laughs> oh, it didn't work. That wyvern is so close to my base. I don't think we can ever go home again. There you go. What level is this guy? I don't know. Oh, he's dead. Okay, he's dead. Now it's just this guy. There you go. Got him. Take that. All right, let's see if we can sneak back. I'm going to leave these two bodies here in case they want them for hide. Or they they might have taken off. They were probably running for their lives. All right, I'll finish gathering this. We'll at least get a little more hide, but I just don't know. I'm not real sure what we can do now. We're kind of just stuck until we can do something. I think that Spino ate the Diplo, so that's gone. What's on the other side of that? What kind of Fiomi are you? What kind of Fiomi are you? Just a vanilla one? Let me see. Just a vanilla one. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's start working on some Trank stuff. If he doesn't go too far. Oh, also, why didn't I check to see if we can get the drop? Check the drop. We can just G it. Yeah, there you go. Oh, nice. Supplies. Okay, let me go work on at least a bow and some arrows. What, what level are we now? We're up to level 24. So let's go like that, like that. And speed. Got to be just fast enough to keep away from the dinos. All right. And then we need a bow. Let's get a bow made up. I know we'll be able to, pretty quickly we'll be able to do. Yeah, if that Fiomia stays there, we can go for it. Yeah, pretty quickly we can do a crossbow, but we're not worried about that just yet. Because we are over level 20, so we can do a smithy and a forge. Just hopefully my base doesn't get wiped by this guy over here. All right. Run back to base. And then we'll get some arrows made up. Let me see what kind of arrows we can do. I know we have two of those potent arrows, so we can use that on him. And then tame him up kind of quickly. All right, like that. It is getting dark. It is getting a little bit late in the day. All right, I need a little bit of food. We're starving. Put that on our nine slot like always. There you go. Some food. Okay, now let's go. Let's look at the forge. The forge, we're short one stone. And then we need... 75 metal ingots for the... Oh, that's a food cooker. Oh, interesting. I thought it was a Primal Fear bench. Alright, then we'll go like that. Alright, we got our first forge down. And I know we got just a little bit of metal. Let's see, metal... We got 16 whole metal. Alright. Get some wood, and we'll make a little bit of metal ingots. We'll get a smithy. And let's start working on arrows. Just make like a small amount of arrows. 
And then we'll turn that into a small amount of Trank Arrows. All right, there we go. And then what do we need? We need five for the Smithy, I think. Perfect. Okay, so that's going. Let's check. Last bit of this, this, and that. Okay, arrows. So I can actually make a few more of the potent ones. There's five more of that one. And then six of that one. Awesome. And then we'll go put those on here. That's on our five slot. Put the other ones on our six slot. And that's pretty much it right now. For right now, that's all we got. But that's pretty good. All right, we're going to drop all that. And let's go on a quick run. Metal. We got enough metal now to do a smithy. Let me do a smithy. And I don't. I don't think we'll have enough to do. We could probably do a metal pick. Let's do a metal pick real quick. All right. That battle music out there is making me super nervous, but we're okay. Now, uh, crossbow. When do we unlock crossbow? Not yet. Uh, metal. Metal pick. We've got. So we get that. So we can increase how much we're getting. There you go. Fortitude's almost where it needs to be. So we can stop pumping that. Let's leave that here because we're probably going to die. And let me just make sure. We unlocked a crossbow now, but it's seven. And we don't we don't have that. Okay, let's let's do this. We're going to actually try to gather real quick and hopefully not die. Like that. All right. Where's the wyvern? If nothing else, get away from the base so that way we can respawn. All right, quickly there. Oh, these aren't giving me metal. Oh, these aren't like the normal river rocks. Oh, that's too bad. I thought they were. I don't think we're going to get lucky. Not at all. There we go, 16. Got a little bit. There you go, 16 again. Okay, cool. That gives us a little bit. Oh, that guy is so close. Let's go smelt. Right, we're going to smelt the rest of that. And then we just need seven to do the crossbow. And then we need a the mortar pestle. So the pestle times one. All right, throw this bad boy right here. Everything's gonna be kind of tightly stacked in here to begin with. All right, so this guy, can we make any more of these? Uh, do we not have any? Oh, I need spoiled meat, okay. I think there's a meat spoiler. We can go meat spoiler. Oh, it's expensive. Uh, oh, we can spoil meat on our inventory. I forgot about that. That is a new thing. Or it's not new, but it, I, don't, I actually don't know what allows you to do that. All right, meat spoiler. Let's go like that. Like that, there you go. That'll be tons of spoiled meat. There's our metal. Here is our crossbow. Like that, like that, like that. Okay, and then we'll get rid of this one. this one there you go and put the right arrows on that one there you go we got a crossbow with a few things in it now we got spoiled meat so now maybe we can go narcotic like that okay we got five of those so five times six thirty nice that'll be enough to go knock out something all right arrow like that make sure i have the mijo berries what else do we have in here let's grab mijo berries Okay. All right. Please don't die. I'm going to save some of that. I'm also going to leave my pick here just because I'm afraid I'm going to die. All right. Let's go. All right. We're going for it. Here we go. Fiomi abound. If we can, we can knock out the Fiomi and at least have our first little rideable dino. Oh, something's right there. Oh, it's just a moth. Okay. I don't even remember how to tame moths, honestly. There it is. There's that a, is that our Fiomi, buddy? Okay, let's go. Oh, that was awesome. Good throw. Okay, switch to the good arrows. He's a level two something, so I don't know if we can knock him out or not, but we'll try. Hopefully. And I don't know if it's one of those things that I need to wait. Or if we just shoot him quickly. I don't know. <laughs> I really, really don't know. Oh, he's out. Okay, cool. He's out. So then we go... All the berries in the world. And then this guy, if he lands, I can try to tame a moth. I've, I don't think I've tamed a moth since back in the Scorched Earth days when Scorched Earth first came out. 
All right, where, where's our buddy at here? Let's see how he's doing. Oh, he's rolling. Okay, cool. He'll be ready soon. My bad. There you go. Don't get hit by the stuff. I don't know what level he is, but let's see if we can just knock him out. What level are you? 340? Oh, there's no way. All right, I'll shoot him for a couple minutes. We'll wait for our Fiomi to wake up over there. Oh, I don't want to spend too many arrows like this. This just feels like a bad idea. Until I can tell how much torpor he has, it's just fully a waste. Yeah, he can have like hundreds and hundreds of torpor. I'm going to wait. We're going to waste all of our arrows like that. How you doing, buddy? You almost ready? Awesome. And then we got to go make a Fiomia saddle. Do we have a Fiomia saddle that we can make? We do. Uh, not toxic, just a regular. Regular Fiomia saddle. All right, we got our first little buddy. Come on, dude. Don't die. This is not a good neighborhood. We got to get back inside. All right, we'll go back. We'll make a... I think we can make a saddle because I think I have enough hide. And I don't know if they... I don't think they gather berries or anything, but we can try. All right, let's go like that. Okay, Fiomia. Times one. We're missing 12 hide. No. Okay. For right now, let's just get you inside. Uh, switch to manual. Can you fit in a door? Is Fiomia one door? Can you? Yeah, you can. Nice. Our little piggy elephant. What's up, buddy? Follow distance lowest. We have a tame. There you go. I was afraid we wouldn't get a tame. We have a tame. He's all up on our bed. All right, 328 Fiomia. Let's get this guy named. Let's go like that, like that. All right, so obviously we got to go with something super easy. We'll go Poop Machine as our first guy here. There you go. We have a Fiomia. We got Poop Machine. Nice. Okay, cool. There's our first addition. Let's close you. Peek out one more time. That guy is teasing just a little bit. I wonder if we could kill him, though. We could definitely try to kill him. There we go. Oh, yeah, that hit us. Okay. Oh, there you go. Now our death marker is showing. Why wasn't it showing earlier? That is weird. It just straight up wasn't showing earlier. Now it's good. Okay. I'm just going to need you to hit you like a thousand times. I don't think it's going to work. Are you even getting bloody? Are you even noticing we're here? He's getting bloody. Yes, we got it. Nice. Okay. I don't know if we, if gathering you is worth it or not, but let's do it. Yep, I know. We're, we're, we're drowning. Oh, we got silk. Silk and chitin. I didn't know that. Plus, more important, we got a couple levels out of it. That's kind of the big thing. So six more levels. We're up to 31 already on day one. That is a good day one. All right. So let's go ahead and one. Speed. Weight. There we go. All right. Fortitude's pretty much maxed out. Level 31. That is big. All right. Now, did, did I get any hide from that? I didn't. I was hoping we got hide. We got to go out searching one more time, but that wyvern over there is bad news. Let's go this way a little bit. I don't think we can really tame this guy, and I'm really afraid of that guy right there. But I wanted to see. You guys are passive, right? There you go. I'm going to just feed him once and then leave him alone for a long time. And if he doesn't get hit or anything, we can go back and feed him up a bunch of times. We'll let that hunger meter go like crazy for a while. All right, we'll see if it works. Oh, here we go. We can get another little buddy. What? Oh, I thought I saw something up there. Okay. Listro buddy, what's up? Let's get you. And you. That's a female. That is a male. Oh, egg layers. Oh, if we could pull this off, we can get our first egg layers. All right. We got ants coming. Let's do the ants. All right. We'll ignore the guys for just a minute. I'm so glad our damage numbers are showing again. I guess we someone had done the taggled, toggle damage numbers or something. I don't know. Okay, come on. Need you to die. We should probably start pumping melee. 62 is not great. There you go. There you go, another one dead. Almost done. There you go. All right. Gather these guys up. I'll pull the thing up in just a second so we can see how much the Listros want. This one here. There we go. All right. So let's check on our Listro buddies. This, these would be huge because there's some egg layers for us. 
All right, you and you. Oh, their food drains so fast. Actually, did you get hit? No, you didn't. There you go. Feed you a bunch. Oh, one more. Okay. How about you? Come on. We got to get fed and get out of here. There you go. Okay, stop that. All right. Come on with me, buddy. Let's go get your little friend here, and then we got to get back to base. It'll be the longest Listro walk ever. Come on, guys. Oh, there's a drop, too. Perfect. Please give me something really good. All right. Everybody coming? Oh, is that an elder? It's an elder moss chomps. That's kind of awesome. We definitely can't do that anytime soon. But all right. We're going to get these guys back to base. I think we're actually going to end it there because that's a, a good day one. Not too much into the primal fear side of things, but at least we got, uh, you know, a little bit of a start going. We got a starter hut. We have ourselves a decent location to start with. We'll definitely move into a better area eventually. We got to get these guys inside. I'll get an egg crate made up as soon as we can, which I think we just... We probably unlock now. Let's do this. Let's go like that, like that. Stop pumping that and start doing melee next. Let's see, egg. Yes, we got the egg crate. So I can leave these guys sitting out to make eggs for us. And we'll have at least a few eggs to start getting into the kibble stuff. All right. Is that a, is that a, oh, oh, hold on. Where are you guys at? Let's get you guys back because I can't lose you. And then we'll come back for one more thing. Before the video's over, we can go for Perry the Parasaur over here. All right, what you got? We got medium crop plot and a compass. That's what we've always wanted. All right. We already got names for these two also. Check this out. We got this guy is like that. So TDF. And that's hip. And TBF hop. There you go. Hip and hop. Let's go, buddies. All right, first egg layers. Let's go. Come on, right in the door. Please make it in without trouble. Oh, one of you did. Oh, don't step on the fire, dude. Okay. All right, our guys are in. Close the door. Okay, cool. Now I just need to see if I can make the egg crate. So we can start getting some eggs collected. What do we need for it? We need. We got it all. Nice. All right. Put the egg crate down. All right, we're going to actually put you guys on mating so we can start increasing your numbers. There you go. Don't die on me. And then we'll turn this on, enable fertilize pickup. All right, last thing we have to do. We're going to go ahead and try to get just a couple more arrows made. Uh, we need more arrows. And we can make a couple more of these. All right, perfect. We had just a little bit more narcotic left. All right, let's go try to get this parasaur. That dude's making me nervous. I hope he can't glitch onto the ground and eat everything. All right. Where's our little parasaur friend? If he's an okay level, we'll grab this guy. Not if he's an okay level. No matter what level he is, we'll try to grab him if he's still alive. There he is. All right. What level are you? Who knows? A four something. Dang, I don't know if we can get him or not. We're going to try. There you go. Oh, I'm so glad the damage numbers are working now. Eventually, we'll have a spyglass so we can tell how much we're doing here. All right. We're just going to get all these shot in there. Hopefully, he passes out for us. And I know these stack. I don't think we have to wait on these, right? I'll just shoot all of them if we get... There you go. All right. Hopefully, we didn't hit him after. Let's go ahead and get you some berries. I'll grab him more berries while you're sitting there. All right. Quick berry collection. And then we have a para, which I'm pretty sure the para can gather, right? If so, then we're good to go. All right, I just need mijo berries, please. Not getting any luck. There you go. A little bit of mijo. All right. Eating super fast. Good job. Get some more mijo. There's some other ones as a backup. Keep gathering. And then maybe we can make a para saddle since I can't make the other saddles. Get more here. Get more of that. All right, where are we at? Let's go ahead and put the rest of that on there for you. We're at 37. We still need more. I want him to eat all Mijos. That way he'll tim up faster. Oh, but this will be the last thing we do. So we'll do this, and then that'll be a great end of the day. If we can get the Parasaur up, that is a pretty successful day one 
even though we're on primal fear it's just gonna it's gonna be a day or two before we really get into any primal dinos like it's just gonna it's gonna be a minute all right let's go like that 53 we got 32 more of those awesome we're good to go now all right no 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 what are you doing no hold on all right ready got him okay hold on I need this this is 220 we gotta kill him before he gets out of the bola there you go 186 in the head perfect yes okay he definitely messed up the taming on this guy that's okay gave us some hide though thank you uh knockdown to 49 percent effectiveness but that's okay so instead of level 600 he'll be 499 that's okay but he's almost done. I didn't know Dimorphodon's attack like that, though. I don't didn't know that was a thing. You were getting low on health, too. Come on, you're still close, dude. 93. 96. One or two more bites. All right, there it is. And can I make the Parasaur saddle? Let's see if we can just make it honor ourselves. Parasaur. I need... Quite a bit more hide. We need 80, and I've only got 48. But let's see if we got a little bit more at base. All right, man. I think that's a great end of the day. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to the patrons to make these servers possible. As I said in the beginning of the video, if you guys are interested in joining the servers, all you got to do is join over on Patreon.com or in the membership down below. And we do that just because it, it allows me to run these servers. Otherwise, I couldn't afford to run the servers. So huge shout out to the patrons that allow me to do that. Uh, what happened to our guy? Uh... Okay. We lost our parasaur. He got thwarted by a tree. There we go. Come on, dude. It's dangerous out here. You're out here messing around. Let's go. All right. Like I said, we'll get him back. That'll be the end of it. Thank you so much. I will see you in the next one. If made to the end of the video, my MVP, and I appreciate you. I might have to remove the top wall to get him in the base, but we'll get him in the base. We'll stack him in. I'll try to build the base a little wider around it so we've got more room. Let's go like that that let's also pick up this pick up the door let's bring Perry inside come on buddy come in let's get you behavior nope behavior follow distance low all right come on can you not get in okay hold on pick up the door frame how about now okay how about now. There you go. Stay right there.